Samaritan Pass Free Surgeries at Juba Teaching Hospital began in 2011. The group says 79 patients benefited from the free ongoing surgeries and are now able to afford a smile once again. Karen Daniels is the Samaritan Pass Program Manager for the Cleft and Palates Program in South Sudan. Daniels says the rainy season prevented the group from reaching many patients across the country. We seem to never run out of lip and we know that these children, uh, 1 in 700 cleft lips uh, will be born worldwide if you think about that. So that's the kind of incidence we're looking at. So we know the lips Will continue to come. Cleft lip and cleft palate are openings or splits in the upper lip palate or both. Cleft lip and cleft palate results when facial structures that are developing in an unborn baby does not close completely. Cleft lip and cleft palate are among the most common birth defects. They commonly occur as isolated birth defects but are also associated with many inherited genetic conditions or syndromes. Our Leo Lolab is a chief from Kapoita North County in Eastern Equatorial State. He brought his granddaughter for the free surgery. Lolab says his granddaughter faced discrimination due to her cleft lips. We came here yesterday and she was immediately sent to the operation room. Thank God she is fine now and her looks have really changed from the previous one with cleft lips. Other kids used to laugh at her and other young girls used to irritate her and she was always triggered to fight with her age mates. Local Elogi, a 28-year-old mother of four, says she left all her work behind in Kapoita South County for the free surgery. I was born with cleft lips and I have been suffering from the attitudes of the people in my community and they used to call me many names. So I'm very grateful to this organization for offering me this surgery now and all appreciation to God for the successful surgery. Bidali Justin, Samaritan Pass's national coordinator for the Cleft and Cataracts program, says some patients with underlining health factors did not qualify for the surgery. Some that has a condition that uh, beyond repair in Juba, and uh, we we are we have an affiliation with the hospital in uh, in Kenya that we will uh, refund them to Kenya to have their uh, their surgeries done. Samaritan Pass says. The Yuba Teaching Hospital team and the National Mobilization for Cleft Lip Surgery helped to create awareness about the free surgeries. The group says it's preparing for another free surgery event in April 2025. For VOA News, I am Juliana Shapai in Juba.